Hi, I'm Ross. Welcome to Deku Digest, your weekly series about movies and shows available on Deku, the only streaming service dedicated to gay men. This week, let's talk about Big Gay Love, Sleepover, and Austin's Love. You can watch any of these right now on our YouTube Primetime channel. First up, Big Gay Love. I think I DVR'd Ellen. Bob, we need to talk. About what? Do you find me attractive? What kind of a question is that? Go on. You were about to say something. Something like, it's not you, it's me. What are you doing here? We had an appointment to talk about my comeback, remember? Oh, right. Can you come back another time? I get it. You're gay. And you need some hot and heavy man-on-man -man action. But you don't have to shove it in my face. This is my apartment. Hi, I'm Andrew Darcy. Well, I'd shake your hand, Andrew, but I see you've got them full. Aren't you that, that pinup model from the 1970s? <laughs> I just might be. But we don't have to go into the details or the decade. Well, why didn't you tell me that your mom's a living legend? I try not to tell anyone. You do your best to raise them the best way you know how. And how do they repay the favor? Toss me out onto the street, why don't you? Great idea. I am making my comeback, and I was hoping that you would help me throw a party. I can't. Bob, she's your mom. You have no idea. I have been entertaining her since I was a child. Besides, I have a lot on my mind. Share with me, Bob. I'm buying a house. When do we move in? Oh, there is no we. Oh, well, I gotta say, I'm a lot less worried about you now that you have a man in your life. I just hope he sticks around long enough to come to my party. Written and directed by Ringo Lay, Big Gay Love stars Jonathan Lasecki as Bob, a lovelorn, wisecracking, plus-size party planner who is in desperate need of finding Mr. Right. And he may have just found him in Andy, a sweet chef played by Buffy the Vampire Slayer star Nicholas Brendan. But with his catty friends commenting from the sidelines, his overbearing actress mom interfering, and his own doubts and insecurities about his body, is there any chance for this affair to succeed? Big Gay Love offers a sharp rebuke to the superficiality of body obsession. It's a witty and fast-paced romantic comedy telling a refreshingly original story about one lonely duck finding love in a pond of swans. Next up, Sleepover. Det är inte riktigt. Men... Se upp det då. Ja, men se upp mig. Ja, men om du ändå inte trivs så måste du ju göra någonting åt saken. Prata med din chef. Berätta hur du känner. Jo, jag vet inte riktigt hur han skulle reagera bara. Kanske får sparken till och med. <laughs> Nej, du får inte. Nej. Jag lägger bara här, ja. Ja, då. An eight-minute short film from Swedish director Jimmy Bal Peterson, Sleepover follows Emil and Adam, two seemingly straight young men who have been friends since junior high. After a night together at the movies, Emil decides he's going to crash at Adam's apartment. The two end up sharing a double bed, and in the middle of the night, Emil awakens, and his unspoken feelings for Adam start to become clear. But is he willing to test the boundaries of their friendship? A simple but well-executed short film, Sleepover perfectly captures those youthful pangs of unrequited love. Finally, Austin's love. Uh, no what? 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 いやいやいや、
と一人でやりますから。Tin has been single his whole life. One day, he discovers that his boss secretly harbors romantic feelings and is even willing to leave his wife to be with him. Tin confides this news to his friends, only to discover that his coworker and flatmate Muk is also deeply in love with him. Even though Tin has never even thought about dating another man, he finds himself overwhelmed by his new popularity and slowly falling for the men who hold him dear. Originally broadcast in Hong Kong, Awesome's Love is a charming romantic series based on a Japanese drama of the same name. And both shows are notable as the first mainstream television series to feature gay love as a central storyline in their respective regions. Have you seen these films? Let us know in the comments what you thought, or look us up on Letterboxd, where you can connect with other queer cinema lovers and rate all your favorite gay movies. If you haven't seen them, watch them wherever you can find Deku. Sign up for a free trial to get access to hundreds of gay films. Deku has at least three gay movies every week, on top of its extensive catalog of classics and new films. Please like and subscribe to our channel, and join us next week for another new edition of Deku Digest.